how to add logo to video. That's right, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to add logo to video really quickly, so let's jump straight in. What is the right file format? To add a logo to video, you need your logo to be transparent so it doesn't block your video or other elements. That's just not gonna work. So ideally, you need your logo to be in PNG file format with a transparent background so it fits seamlessly in with your video. So to add a logo to our video, we're gonna use Veed, which is an online video editor, and you can go to veed.io and create a free account. And I'm also gonna link it in the description down below for you. So when you're there, just click on create new project and upload the video that you want to add logo to. Feed is then gonna upload that video and you'll see you've got a timeline down here. You've got your video on the right and you've got some tools on the left. So I want to make this really easy for you and get straight into it. Let's go to upload right here on the toolbar and click on upload image. Find the logo that you want to use, and then Veed will upload your logo straight into your timeline and onto your video, as you can see. So I'm going to resize my logo straight down like that. I can resize using these handles right here to make it smaller. You can also rotate it using this handle right here if you want to rotate it and click and drag it to move it anywhere in your video that you want it to be. And that brings me on to my first tip placement, which is really, really important to get right because you don't want your logo to be on top of or blocking other content in your video, such as subtitles and other elements that you might have in your video. A lot of people take video content and use it for themselves without any permission. So by learning how to add logo to video, you'll avoid people stealing your content. So I would recommend either having your logo at the bottom left here, or top left or top right to avoid your logo being in front of or blocking content. You'll also notice you've got an element on your timeline which is your logo and you can drag this to make it shorter. So this allows you to choose when your logo appears, whether you want it to appear at the start, appear at the end, whenever you want. You can have it the whole length of the video if you want to, just by clicking and dragging just like that. Tip number two is color. You want some contrast between your video and your logo. You don't want your logo to be blending in. You want it to stand out from your video. Now for this video, I've just chosen a little image to use just to show you how to do this. But you could also choose to use a white logo or a black logo, something that stands out from your footage. Now, if you haven't got a logo yet, you could quite easily use text as a logo. And to do that, just go over to text right here and you can add a headline or some regular text. I can change the color of my text right here. And what you can do is type in your name or your business right here to use as your logo. Then again I can drag this around my canvas to choose where I want my logo to be placed. So when you've added a logo to your video you just need to go to export at the top right and export video and Veed will export your video with your logo ready for you to use anywhere that you like. And as you can see you can carry on editing your video, you can download it as an mp4 and you can even download it as a gif if you want to. And that is exactly how you can add a logo to video. Thank you so much for watching, I hope this video has helped you. If you've got any tips, suggestions or questions for me, please let me know in the comments down below, I'd love to hear from you. If this video helped you, please give it a quick like and remember to subscribe if you want to see all our future videos. We've got loads coming up. Thank you so much. See you in the next video.